there's a path I used to take that winds down by the lake where I wander as a lad each time I could. Prairie Musicians is made possible by the Minnesota Arts and Cultural Heritage Fund and the citizens of Minnesota and by the members of Prairie Public. I'm Bruce Nelson, and I'm here today at, at Perry Public with the Friends of Al Siegley Band. It's, it's kind of a little bit of a story. Many of people in the Pelican area knew Al Siegley. He was an educator and just well-loved by everybody. He started a group called Al Siegley and Friends, but then a year ago, August, he passed away on us, and so we're trying to keep his name going, and now it becomes the Friends of Al Siegley Band, and I was fortunate enough, Al asked me to come and sing with him when he started having a little trouble singing, and we've been with him ever since. The group that we have here today is basically from the Earhart Pelican Rapids area. We have with us, Renee Fuchs on the bass guitar. We have Lee Bauman on the rhythm guitar and singing. And we have Dennis Bauman playing the violin for us. And we have Richard Jensen playing the banjo for us. Some of the songs that I've done today, uh, one is uh, My Minnesota Home. How I love those maple hills of Minnesota in the maple-covered hills where I did grow. Which is uh, it just kind of a takeoff on the beautiful area that I was, was raised in, in Maplewood area of south of Pelican Rapids and down in that area, uh, just south of the big Maplewood Park, actually. It's such a, such a beautiful place. It took 40 years for me to realize that it, how pretty it really was, but uh, eventually it sunk in, and, and that's where the song came from. There's a path I used to take that winds down by the lake where I wander as a lad each time I could. As a young boy there I found that real peace did abound in this place where I live called Maplewood. My thoughts still wander back to that old familiar shack in those maple-covered hills so far away. Where I played there as a child, my memories run wild, and there is where I really want to stay. How I love those maple hills of Minnesota, in the maple covered hills where I did grow. It was there I learned to love, battle the sky up above, right there in my Minnesota. 
my mind I still go back to that tumble down old shack where all my childhood memories remain those thoughts are still so strong and I know that I belong in those hills with all those maple trees again as I go back there in thought old memories are sought and I'm longing for the days that were so good that's just when I wanna be so when I die please bury me in those beautiful old hills of maple wood how I love those maple hills of Minnesota in those maple covered hills where I did grow it was Well, the next song uh, we're going to put Lee to work on, and does an excellent job on it. And uh, Renee and I come in and do some harmonies, and and uh, I don't think the Statlers have anything to worry about, but uh, but it uh, it does come out as a pretty pretty nice song, and it's one that the Statlers did called "You Are My Sunshine." Take it away, Lee. He was standing by the crowd, all alone, looking pretty, listening to the music that we played. He walked up and whispered, I'll leave him down and listen to the request that she made. Do you know who you are? You are my sunshine. She has so sweet and tenderly. in my pocket. 
again I don't see any troubles in my way Well now the whole world smells like roses That's why the good Lord gave us noses And I sure hope it's gonna stay that way Well now sunlight's shining on the world around me And things are going great in every way And the only thing that I can say this morning It's gonna be a beautiful day Yes, it's gonna be a beautiful day The next one we're gonna put uh, Rich to work and it's a little song called I Thought I Had Seen Pretty Girls in My Time. I thought I had seen pretty girls in my time That was before I met you I never saw one that I wanted for mine That was before I met you I thought I was swinging the I thought I'd been kissed and I thought I'd been loved That was before I met you Another one that uh, that I sang today, it's called, I Think You're Just a Little Too Late. A, uh, I like to call it the story of my life. It's, uh, it's not exactly a happy story, but it's, uh, it's kind of funny, so that, that makes up for it, I guess. They repossess my car, I said I'll get it back again. I'll fight those finance people right to the bitter end. Here's my delinquent payment, and I'll give you some to boot. Oh, now give me back my car and take my loot. 
They said, we think you're just a little too late. You see, we can't mess around while you procrastinate. We auctioned off your car, well, that's the way we are. I'm sorry you're a little too late. Well, now I had to take the city bus to get to work on time. Well, I missed the one at eight. I had to take the one at nine. I finally got to work about a quarter after ten. And I went to tell the foreman where I'd been. He said, I think you're just a little too late. You see, that's, well, that's the kind of stuff I hate. Now, I don't want to make you sore, but we can't use you anymore. Sorry you're a little too late. Well, now we come to the part about wedded the bliss. You know, uh, why they call marriage a three-ring circus, don't you? Because there's three rings involved. There's First, there's the engagement ring, and then there's the wedding ring, and lastly, there's the suffer ring. Well, my wife packed up and left me. I said, she can't do that to me. I guess I'll have to show her what a lover I can be. I bought a dozen roses. I said, baby, please come home. Your lover boy can't stand to be alone. She said, I think you're just a little too late. You see, I've done gone and found myself another mate. He's handsomer than you. He's got a car. He's working, too. I'm sorry you're a little too late. Well, now, after that divorce, I ended up without a dime. I mean, you can see that I was forced to lead a life of sin and crime. Well, I plundered and I gambled and I smoked and cursed and drank. And I even tried to rob the local bank. They said, we think it's just a little too late. You see, there ain't nothing in our vault for you to take. You're the second crook to name that other rubber, he got away. I'm sorry you're a little too late. Well, now the time I spent in jail has made me see that I was wrong, so I've decided to repent and take it easy from now on. And when I die, climb those golden stairs on Judgment Day, the man will probably look at me and say, I think you're just a little too late. You see, we're filled up right now. You're going to have to wait. Why don't you go on down below? If something breaks, we'll let you know. I'm sorry you're a little too late. I'm sorry you're just a little too late. There's a light that is fairer than day. And my face. Yeah. 
Well, the next song that we're going to do, uh, we're going to put Dennis to work on the violin, and, uh, and it's a little song called Maple Sugar. I think everybody recognizes that as an old standby, and, and Dennis does a wonderful job on it. And here he goes. Well, uh, it would fit right in with Al's uh, M.O. He, uh, he, he loved to, to play music and, and he loved to entertain people. We are still doing some of the nursing homes that he started singing at and playing at 20 years ago or better. Actually, uh, I've slowed down myself so that, that basically that's what we do. We do uh, nursing homes and Bet's Home in Fergus and, and various places like that. And I must admit, it, it's because of greedy circumstances that I do that, because I'm, I'm going to be there one day, and I want somebody to come and sing for me. Prairie Musicians is made possible by the Minnesota Arts and Cultural Heritage Fund and the citizens of Minnesota. 
and by the members of Prairie Public.